So I'm back at home for Christmas and I want to say a huge thank you to everyone. We hit 45,000 subscribers, which is honestly incredible. Thank you to everyone who's been supporting the channel. I hope you all had an amazing Christmas and I can't wait to produce some content over the Christmas period. But let's jump into the video. This is the best place to shop in Sheffield. Dom here from Payday Pickups and I'm back with another video. In today's video, we are doing another best places to shop. We are in the city of Sheffield. Right behind me is the skate park. But now let's head on to one of the main shopping streets, Division Street. So right now we are at the top of Division Street. There's two sides, a load of cool restaurants and a load of clothing stores. The first spot we're hitting up is this vintage store called Vulga. So let's head on inside. <laughs> the store as well the attention to detail all the little kind of like things on the wall we have the big mcdonald's sign with the haribo kid and the whole setup just really nice then we've got a load of vintage tees we've got some summit series we've got some champion we've got old nike let's see what else we got we've got this sick nautica tee i love the wash on it kind of like washed out nice kind of minimal cracking on the screen print So one of the best segments of the Vulgar store is they have a full-on vintage designer section. So right here we have this vintage iceberg shirt, we have this vintage Burberry shirt with the Burberry logo all over. Only for £45 off for a Burberry shirt that's absolutely a steal. We've got Dolce & Gabbana, let's see what else we've got. D&G pants, we've got APC, just good essentials. We've even got Stone Island man, Stone Island in a thrift store, you never see that. £68 as well. That's so much cheaper. This would be like £200 retail. So that was Vulgar Vintage. Let's head on to the next store. So two doors down from Vulgar Vintage, the next store is called the Alternative Store. Very, very simple stuff, kind of like contemporary renswear. We've got like Huff, Dickies, Patagonia, but let's head on inside. Dickies cardio pants, Dickies embroidered sweatshirt. We got the whole wall of hats, we got hooks. Once again, we got Dickies, we got a load of beanies. This is from their own brand, the Alternative Store. Another thing with the pieces in the Alternative Store, they're all very high quality, like they use a load of good materials, like these fleeces, a load of the work pants. These are pieces that cost a little bit more, but they'll last you for the rest of your life. So it's pretty much just all like the contemporary kind of workwear stuff. So with like raincoats, simple bag packs. into that whole style aesthetic then the alternative store is perfect for you. Nice to meet you. See ya. The fans are over now. <laughs> yes. I see. So just saw a few fans of Sheffield, they watched my videos. Really slick to be guys. Really nice guys and recommended me a few more stores which I didn't know about. So we're gonna go to this one, literally across the road. You can see it in the background it's called YSM. So head on inside. Like they used to like sell for stock at acne studios and they usually always sell out so you can get this tea. I've wanted this for ages. The statement acne studio shoe, honestly so clean. See the, the, the best high quality essentials of all the acne studios, thick quality t-shirts, high neck, and then just a simple minimal clean print. So another brand they stock in here, which you rarely see in any stores, literally apart from Selfridges, is the only store I know of it, it is Represent. They're actually a brand from the UK. The two lads, George Heaton and Tom, they literally started this brand like four years ago now, and they've literally grown it to one of the biggest brands in the world.
Once again, brands you don't find in many cities apart from the big department stores like Selfridges and stuff like Palm Angels. So if you're in Sheffield, you definitely have to come shop here. It's probably the only place that's gonna stop here. Once again, another brand you rarely see in normal high street stores. We have off-whites, we have the signature stripes, we have the shoes with the red treasury tags, and we have the off-white belt. That store, honestly overwhelmed with that. Like, I couldn't believe some of the brands stocked in there like represent. They're the only store in the whole of the UK, apart from Selfridges or Harvey Nicks, that stocks represent. And then Palm Angels Off-White, it's definitely something they need in Sheffield. So across the street and two doors down from YSM, we have a skateboard shop. It's called Slugger. On top we have all the decks, we have all the hats and a variety of different brands and we've got a load of different skate shoes, Adidas, Snips, how we pronounce it, <laughs> uh, we've got just a simple van slip on, checkerboards, a few more skateboard brands, we've got Bronze 56k, kind of the Windows 97 and then we also have Polar Skaters too. Another thing that's really good about Slugger is they don't go for like all the main brands like Nike, they go for kind of like the core independent brands. They said Polar, we've got Wayward which is from London, and also the brand Sex. This is a brand from Sheffield, so they're stocking other brands in Sheffield, which is really good to see. So right opposite Slugger Skate, it is another vintage store, it's called Mooch Vintage. So let's head on inside. Oh my god, they got run over. <laughs> Already we have the Champion Reverse Weave track shorts. For all you NBA lovers, we have a load of vests, basketball jerseys, the Celtics, we've got the Lakers. Oh my god, that's so sick. The proper vintage Heli Hansen jacket. HH reflective sailing jacket with the patch. So sick. Vintage brand Benetta, and this is literally from the 90s. True vintage. So, if you want to help the planet with sustainable fashion, then you don't need to buy brand new Levi's jeans. Come to vintage stores like this, so many different like Levi's, all different colors, all different fits. definitely go head on side if you're ever in Sheffield. So once again, the wind wrecked the audio, but the next store is called Sakis. It's a mixture between a load of contemporary brands as well as streetwear brands, but let's head on inside. the contemporary brands just the high quality essentials we have the Norse projects very well known for their high in quality another well-known contemporary brand is the brand called Falk nice fall kind of tones and colors we've got like the khaki greens the corduroys the stripes just very very simple but high quality so if you the shoes they stock it is one of the designer brands it is called filling pieces just very minimal silhouette and when it comes to more of the chunky kind of sportswear shoes we have the Sorkinis, very nice comfy and then last but not least we have infamous new balance nice chunky aesthetic So the second half of the store is, features more streetwear brands. For example, we have Billionaire's Boy Club. On this side, we have Stussy, nice hoodies, t-shirts. We also have more Stussy right here. And then we also have another skateboard brand, Obey. Let's head on to the next store. Sorry, man. So you take this one from there? So this is Ryan's Vintage, there's one in Leeds, you would have seen my best place to shop in Leeds and this one is literally like four times the size and the best thing with Ryan Vintage is they do the stuff for so cheap, literally everything's like £20 and under. So 
you can get find a load of sick track jackets good for like the festival season so many different colors see the thing with good and Ryan is you have so much to root through you can pretty much find everything and you can sometimes find some unbelievable steals so just found this bootleg Louis Vuitton bag only for five pounds real leather too I'm thinking to use this for a custom or kind of Air Force One cut out a Nike tick and then just sew them on looks so weird in my handbag <laughs> so we're gonna wrap it up at Ryan's Vintage and I'm probably gonna get some lunch now we've been filming like the past like six or seven stores we're getting pretty hungry kind of a break and then we're gonna head down the rest of West Street and showcase them a few more stores So the next store we're going to talk about it is another vintage thrift store. It is called Cow. You would have seen this in my Manchester video. Let's head on inside. Carhartt jackets. So sick. Carhartt worker jackets. Benjas tee, Hawaiian shirts, corduroy pants. The colour of these is actually so nice. We have like flannels, just a load of unbranded a mixture of just printed graphic tees. Once again, all colour coordinated. Another sick Helly Hands and 90s sailing jacket. Blue, red, and white. One of the best colorways. Sick, this is a polo bear fleece. These are really hard to come across. Embroidered for 85 pounds. It's pretty mad, these NASCAR kind of crop top turtlenecks. They've customized them, put up the higher neck, and they've also cropped them and put them double stitching. So, so sick. Colours are so sick, like turquoise, sky blue. I think it looks sick if you cropped it up. So that was it for West Street. If you also come down West Street, it's really good for some bars and food. It's got a load of different things for nights out and stuff like that. So in between West and Division Street, we have another vintage shop called Freshman's. This is called Freshman's Vintage. It's been here for 25 years. One of the OG vintage stores in Sheffield and it literally stocks pretty much everything. On the higher walls is all like the bit rarer pieces. Like you can see over there, like the sick vintage Mickey pieces. It's pretty sick, always Coca-Cola, kind of like gym sports bag. We've got the Anarchy East Pack. As once again, sustainable fashion, get your secondhand jeans. Instead of buying brand new ones, help the planet to get your secondhand jeans. Where are we going next? So we're going to the last spot in the city centre. It is called Thrifty Shop. Once again, another vintage store. Sheffield is just renowned for its vintage clothing. So the next stop, as I mentioned before, it is Thrifty Shop, another vintage store. Sheffield has got so, so many. Sick chinos, we've got the Ralph Lauren, we've got the Tommy Hill figures, the old school 90s Tommy Hill figure, Dickies, and not even the old school 90s polo. Load of just vintage sportswear sweatshirts, we've got Adidas, nice three stripes. Ah. Got the Adidas original, Reebok, Kappa, Umbro. Nike display right here, all spray painted staircase with all the I vintage mean, shoes, boots, caps. I know these are battered, but these are the Comme de Garçon Converse. These are actually very rare to come across nowadays. Another sick thing about the store is they hold a few other small brands. This is called Founding Studio, all custom one of one pieces, just a load of multi colours. Overall, that 
one of the best places to shop in Sheffield. There's also two other stores which I didn't mention. They're a bit outside the city centre, more in the student area in Ecky Road. There is Jojo's Vintage Place and Pirate Ship. I'll leave the links in the description box below. Be sure to comment your favourite store and also any of the cities that you want to see me do this series. Be sure to check out my other ones in like Manchester, Liverpool, Berlin and Leeds. And if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that subscribe button and also that notification bell. And also give it a thumbs up and I'll see you lot in the next one.